Hi, friends. Hello, everyone. I am Dr. Mini. Hello, everyone. I'm barely the partner of Dr. Mini. After our exploration on Flamas last month, we discovered a new energy source, Celestium. Under the joint development of our team, we finally created items that can harness this energy. You must have experienced it. But from the feedback you guys gave us, we found that you still have a lot of questions about the new Celestium items. Our team is still working hard to develop and improve these Celestium items. Before new items are released, please allow us to briefly introduce currently launched Celestium items and their functions. Celestium is a kind of energy that spreads among the planets in the mini-world. If you want to obtain this kind of energy, you must obtain Celestium crystals. This crystal occurs in Celestium more, and has only been found in the depths of Flamma so far. Hmm, it seems to be a special ore that could only be condensed under high temperature and pressure. That's right. When Celestium crystals are obtained, you can create brand new Celestium items on the crafting table. The most important one is the Celestium Emission Source called Celestium Light Beamer. It can concentrate the energy in crystal and output. For other tools that consume energy, all of our previous tools that could be powered by electricity can now be activated by this new energy, such as springs, drawing devices, traps, etc. Regarding the specific usage of the items, I will ask my partner Bear to explain to you. Finally, it's my turn. Hi, this is Barely. Presumably, everyone already knows that Dr. Minnie has discovered a brand new energy source, Celestia. Next, I will tell you how Celestia can be better used in our world. Come and see together. Some friends here ask how to use Celestia to make elevators. Actually, the elevator is the same as the old version. The most used are sliding blocks and markers. Let me give you a quick demonstration of how to make an elevator. Prepare the blocks first, and the sequence numbers from left to right are color cement blocks, marker negative, marker positive, sliding blocks, switch, celestium light beamer. Let's make a pillar with a certain height. Place sliding block next to the pillar above. Please note the orientation of the cross button of the sliding block. Align the cross key to place the marker negative and place the marker positive aligned below the bottom. After that, we make an elevator platform. Connect blocks with marker negative. Let's place a Celestium light beamer on a marker positive. Then place a switch, knock the block off their bottom, pull the switch, and a simple elevator is complete. But Bear, if I want to remotely control the switch of the Celestium items, what tools can be used? Uh, the previous switch is now transformed into a device that can control the output of Celestium. As long as the switch is placed on a Celestium light beamer, it can be controlled. Mmm, great! With the elevator, you can use the floating island as a base. It is really a safe and convenient building. Thank you, Bear, for sharing. But next, what I want to share is the new items we developed this time. Transporter! This is a brand new device that uses Celestium as a driving force. It can transfer items to designated storage boxes and supports filtering based on requirements. We hope that this device can be used to harvest and collect crops automatically. Under normal circumstances, we can utilize the power of water flow to harvest crops. The crops harvested by the water flow are automatically collected into the storage box through the pipe. Realize the full automation of harvesting and collection. With so many new items introduced, do you have a new understanding of Celestium? Let's take a look at the email sent to us by you guys. Some friends ask if this Celestium can do some interesting things. This I have done quite a lot of research. First place an infrared sensor block and set the sensing block of the infrared sensor block to pizza. Players can detect changes by eating the pizza once and will output a signal. At this time, we give the signal to the booster and fire the coconut shells at players who steal pizza. This completes this simple trap. All right, this report ends here. I hope you can enjoy the fun that the Celestium brings. By the way, if you have any questions and suggestions about the Celestium device, you can email us. We will develop more interesting items. 
See you See next, you next time. time.